My name's Chris Wiseman. Everyone calls me Krusty. I'm 28 years old and I'm from Simi Valley, California, but now I reside in Oceanside. I started skating at eight years old, 2002 in March, March 2002. So I've been skating for 20 years. I started out skating a uh, skate lab, it was an indoor skate park in Simi Valley and I would go there almost every single day. I spent a lot of time at Skate Lab growing up from eight years old to the place, to the time it closed down, January 7th, 2019, it closed its doors and I was there for the last session. I think I got home at like three in the morning. I saw a piece of trash, I gotta get it. Look, piece of trash here. They litter. Oh, can't find it now. Oh, it's right here. Sick, man. I haven't used fucking deodorant in like three weeks, dude. I swear. I just come here, like, barely even use soap these days. Like, get that fan salt water, get it. Dude. I met all my childhood friends there Kevin Furman, Lyndon Lindsay. Gage Boyle, Alec Richards, Joey Nungary, Ricky Flores, like we had a crew and we would make skate videos. We'd go out filming on the weekends and we would premiere it usually at Skate Lab and it was always a super great turnout. They always let us rent the place out and throw a premiere and I ended up turning pro December 2nd, 2018 at a video called Debauchery 2. Um, it was one of our full length videos. So Skate Lab was very responsible for me pursuing skating to where I get to where I am today. Skate session. Thank God we're by the ocean. We're about to go to the hot shit too. YouTube comments are gonna be like, dude, this fool is not about to skate with those feet right now. <laughs> but I am. <laughs> and I don't really mind it. Yeah, a lot of dudes, a lot of riders are like, what the fuck, dude, I can't skate after that, I got rinse. Let's fucking get this shit. It smells like bubble gum. Nice and the good part of the song is coming up. Go, go, go! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Hit it! Dude, hey, wait, wait, wait. One time, I was fucking driving down this street and freaking Milton Martinez gap nose blunts a picnic table right as I'm passing. And he landed it. The roar of the fucking crowd that, dude, it was crazy. It was crazy. I, went, I was actually going to the place we're going to right now. You know, I was going to Walmart with my girlfriend. I, I was like, dude, I gotta go skate. Gap nose blunts. In the footage, you could see the Corolla. I think he did it twice too. So I think it was the first one without the backside wall ride. He bailed the backside 360 wall ride, the one that I'm passing. Very sick. Oh, here it is. Oh, it's bumping, it's bumping, it's bumping. <laughs> this is my liquor scoreboard. Uh, it's really cracked. Place item on the scale. This one didn't have a sensor, so I'm gonna look up item. I gotta look it up. I gotta look it up. What's it called? That's a pear? No, it's a nectarine. Nectarine, which one? Yellow. It's gotta be yellow. <laughs> what are you doing? Have you ever skateboarded? Moving the other side? And then this was a nectarine. Select from list.
<laughs> go, go, go. I want to go skate. Thank you, guys. Let's get in there. Let's go skate. Probably need this. Oh, hell yeah, dude. <laughs> I didn't really see it. God damn it. Oh, skate classes. No, no skate classes. Let's get it. Oh my god, my parking spot's here. Bum, bum, bum. Neutral e brake vent park on an automatic car. Let's get it. <laughs> Do you know any reason there's caution tape? Well, that's put a halt on our mission. That's crazy. This sucks. <laughs> how does that, wait, how did that happen? That's so gnarly. I thought it'd be bad if we had like skate classes. This is so much worse. <laughs> Let's go skate something else. <laughs> it like, dude, I love this hip and I love that nose blunt. The first time I could remember that I'm like, okay, I'm really part of the skate industry was uh, December 23rd, 2013. I, uh, Kevin Furman drove me to Oceanside with James Martin. James Martin is a professional skateboarder from Camarillo, California, and he, I always looked up to him a lot of, he influenced a lot of people in the Ventura County, and he cruised up with us, or, down with us and we went to ATM Click Warehouse and uh, Kevin Fowler, he was a TM at the time and he asked me a few questions. We went out skating. I ended up switched big spin heel flipping this 10 stair in a line in Dana Point and that was the day that I was like, this is, this is on, it's on, you know? And I, I took it super seriously from that day on, 2013, December 23rd. From then on, it was full force filming, you know, like for a sponsor too. It wasn't just like go out with your homies, see if you can get a clip. Now it's like really work hard, you know. At that particular time, it was always uh, handrails, hubbas, stair sets. Still kind of now, I was, a, I was younger, so I could take more impact. I was so super inspired by Zero videos, Baker videos, any of those videos that made you want to huck. I, w I wanted to jump, you know, I wanted to go fast and jump. And that's, that's where it came, I worked really hard. I sent three sponsor made videos to ATM. <laughs> I sent them three and they would always write back, yeah, super hyped, super hyped. And then it was that day that I linked up with uh, James and we linked up and then I was flow. When I got on the team, that was gnarly. That was, my TM was Ronnie Bertino and uh, Ed DeVera was heavily involved. And I remember when I got on, I was doing gnarly. I think I switched, I switched big spin board slid the ring con four block in uh, November, what day was it? November 23rd or something, 2014, yeah. 
Yeah, it was. November 23rd, 2014. I landed, switched Big Spin board side down the Rincon block. And in the footage, you can look at my face and that was the day that I realized like, I just did something that's gonna change my life. I remember, I called my mom and shit. It was crazy, dude. Oh my God, yeah, that was insane. Let's go skate some ditches. We just pulled up to ATM Click and Acid Chemical Co, SOP Distribution. And this is one of the companies I ride for. Hey, this is it. Shapes, dude, look at this shit. Money bombs, dude. That's old school right there. Old school shit. Colorado, stand up. <laughs> oh. They're all crusty, all low key right there. <laughs> Not a lot of people know that, but it says it right there. Crusty. Chase Hartman drew this board. Amazing artist from Oceanside. Pink top. 8.5 bear by this is actually my shape. I should get it. And then uh, Chris Markovich is Chris Wiseman. Got my hometown some love right there. Simi Valley. ATM Oceanside automatic teller machine. Oh, there it is. Uh, 55 is generally what I ride. This one. They came me a header card too, dude. Chris Wiseman. I'll actually, come on, come on. I can show you this thing. I was gonna kill me for this, but boom. So, um, yeah, let's show you the fucking wheel. Let's like actually show you the wheel. Dude, yeah, like fucking blessed me, dude. Fucking sick. Can I show you how to run it? The, the first one never really rips correctly. So, there you go. This one should rip pretty good. So I'm trying to keep all the logos going good. This is pretty sick, dude. It's like two, four. Put the header card. Put the sticker. Slice and dice, dude. There you go. It's always good if you like poke holes. Cause then if you don't poke a hole, it just like blows up on you. So I usually poke like, well, four. Um, always keep it moving. There you go. There's the finished fiber on it, there you go. And then with sticker size, you got 55, correct? And then we have our wheel. 55, if we're doing a lot, like a big quantity, we run it through this machine, throw them in here, and it turns them out, dude, like thousands of wheels. This is for the decks. Turn this on, put a deck in, put this in the foil, conveyor belt puts it in there, stops over there. And this one's actually uh, my shaped board. It's going to Zoomies. Thank you, Zoomies. You guys hooked it up. And it's stacked terribly because the board is shaped. So it's like, it's a nine and a half shape. This is a nine box. So it's really, so it's kind of slanted, but yeah, Zoomies, LNX. And the boards get printed here. This is LNX. We do business with LNX. Rod James, you're the shit. This is the machine that puts the graphics on. Generally, it takes a long time to start. Put it at 3.30, turn it on. Put the machine in there. Green buns go, red buns out, get it. Put it again, green bun go, red out. And then it's sketchy too, because you don't want to get your hands in there, but this thing, if you knee it, it just automatically comes up, which is really rad. No. This is where we keep uh, papers of nice day caches. I just got kicked out. This is transfer papers, ATM transfer papers, top graphics, pro graphics, shaped boards. That's my shape, Donovan's shape, Rex's shape. And then we have shovel nose. This is all of our shapes. So that one's, they hooked me up, dude. So right there, they hooked me up with like, there's like 50, but check this out, dude. This is, this is the crusty shape. So with Zoomies buying 300, it does really well. And I'll show you the ramp, dude. Check this out. It's pretty cool. We're getting inside, you know, or outside. 
Check this out. So we did. Oh, this is sick, dude. Alfonso Rawls came here one time and he sprayed all these red decks. And it was before, it was a year ago, so it wasn't this broken, but he would dry them through this. Apparently this is what they used to dry painted boards back in the day. We did a lot of events with ATM that we got these ramps. We throw events like Flat Bar Friday, so pretty cool. Let's go save it up to the boss. Johnny, 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 Johnny. John, what made you want me on the team? And what made me stand out to you? Because you get a lot of sponsor me tapes. Well, yeah, no, I got three videos, I believe, two or three, and go back and forth. And then I believe we communicated over email. And then uh, James Martin knew who you were too. Yeah, that's who it was, dude, James, James man. James, James threw a, you know, his nudge in, his two cents, and they were positive. And so, okay, come on down. And then you get to meet the person because you already know he's a good skater. And then now you want to see what is he like off the board. And it's been a blessing since then. Thank you to that. It has. We work really well together. Well, we do. We well, do. Yeah. well, you do a lot more work than I do. But I don't know about that one. <laughs> what about now? What about these days? <laughs> All right, what's the next oh, question? Today, today I got to go. Um, I got to cut some wheels for Markovich. I got to go figure out. We got we to gotta work on a new wheel for you. Um, Dude, hell yeah. No, no, you got to do it. New. New. We got to sell this one. No, there's not that many left. That's the, so if we start working on it now, it's because I got to do Markovich, and then I want to do Krusty, and then I want to do Donovan, like have new. Hell yeah. You know, it's good to have new. And then there's some, one other guy I want to talk to about this project too. Let's keep it on the low pro right now, though. I have to. But yeah, this is it. This is what I do for a living. This is it. It's very kind of fucking like, people make it. How can I say this? Um, I'm blessed to be in it this long, but also I'm blessed to know all the, all the guys I've met and hung out with and girls. And it's insane. They, they just make you young. Yeah, I mean, you've been you've been hooking up from Christian Asoy to Tony Alva. Oh, before that. Oh, even before that? Oh, yeah. shit. Yeah, 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 78. So you're thinking like... That's crazy. Uh, Miramoto and uh, Andrecht and uh, Stropo. What was the guy from Santa Monica? Uh, what was his name? Ton Tonan? Tonan. Tonan. That was before Alva? No, no, no he was, was Alva. Alva. No, no, he was not. No, he worked with me. Tone in. In the garage, my, no, in my mom's garage or on, on Rosewood, I forget. Sadie, that's sick, man. Dude, you've been hooking up from those dudes to the Alva guys, to the Jamie Fortunes, to the Kareem Campbells, to the James Martins, to the Krusties, and you're still hooking up riders. You have to. That's crazy. You to. You've been hooking up for like four and a half, five generations of professional skaters. And? That's awesome. You know, <laughs> Thanks for all the skaters that buy our product. We need them more than they need us. Because yeah. that's what gives us the opportunity to support these guys. Keep going, yeah. Um, and the stores, if you ever want to step up, call Glenn. Sadie, come up. All right, John, we're going to take up. Okay. We're going to take off. Thank you for your time. Well, thank you. This is the local skate shop, Asylum Skate Shop. And some people just walked in, so I'm going to take a second to uh, Set up a board, or at least spray paint it. I feel like boards look better with spray painted edges. No disrespect to the artists that have made my pro model boards, but I love painting the sides of them. Thank goodness there's cars here, so maybe I don't get the cops called on me like last time. It really like looks better. I think it looks way better when you do this shit. Dude, fucking sick, dude. It looks way better. And then this is the drying process. <laughs> Usually if you do it in the middle of the street, you get more, see, look, there's wind resistance and shit. How's it look? It's all right. Sick. How are you? This is Brendan Scott. He's a fucking great friend of mine. Best friend. 
Fucking okay, sick. Best friend right here. Good man. You could Google us, you'll find both of us too. Can we go in your shop? Let's fucking do this shit, dude. This is Asylum Skate Shop, Oceanside, California. Super sick. They got a skate juice, loser machine, ATM, acid, just up. Hey, what's going on, guys? What up? How are you guys doing? What up, man? I heard you guys are selling out of the wheels. Yeah, we are. Fuck yeah. <laughs> a lot of history in this skate shop. I love this skate shop because you can see mystery skateboards, Billy Pepper, dude, all these gnarly ass skaters, Provost, all Ellington 012, Jeff Rally. It's got a lot of history, a lot of history in the skate shop. It's really rad. They got right there, Ave, Alien Workshop. This is my favorite skate shop. It's fucking incredible. They got the whole team. Zero, they got OG loser machine boards. What is it, Ernie Torres? Ernie Torres, audio and real skateboards, dude. That's classic, man. Let's go get some stickers. Hell yeah. I have two backpacks, uh, one for the ocean and one for skating. This one is the one for skating. Stickers. <laughs> we link it up today? Fuck yeah. Let's Six o'clock. Six ten. Six ten? Six ten. Do you guys have asylum stickers? Oh! The black one, the black one, the black one, the black one. Please, please, please. Yes, that one looks so sick. Oh yeah. You have a razor blade? Yes, sir. Just it makes it like way more fun when it's like this. Guys, thank you so much for fucking setting me up and best skate shop in town, dude. Seriously, thank you so much, guys. Hell yeah. I'll be the number one supporter of Asylum Skate Shop. Whenever. Fuck, dude. Love you too, B. Scott. Later, Pat Benatar. Hell yeah. Woo. <laughs> Later, homie. Fuck yeah, guys. Oh, I'll see you guys soon. Oh, hell yeah. Later on, boss. This is a gun I got from my brother. I think it was a Christmas present. I have a few, but this one's one of my favorites. What you do is this. It took me forever to learn how to use it, but you gotta put it here, and then that. That's how long that, it took me a long time. Where am I aiming? Let's go for the chest. The chest. Fuck. <laughs> You want to try it? It's fucking gnarly. Dude, they go through. I think that's enough fun for now. Hey, Jojo. I told you I would see you Thursday. I am here Thursday. This is Senor Grubby's. It's my local spot. My girlfriend works here. It's very organic. A lot of my homies cruise over here. It's kind of the spot to be at, you know? Great food. Great beer, Ryan downtown. This is my spot. Remind me your name. Oh my God, how could I forget? Here you go, man. Eight and a half, bareback wood too. Thank you. Enjoy it, man. Oh, Hell yeah. yes. Hell or this, dude. Killer. All right, later. later on, boss. Enjoy the board. Always gotta support the youth. Yeah. Keep a pint. 
I didn't get blocked in, honey. No, because you parked in the only space where you wouldn't get blocked in. Here you go, gorgeous. Let's go in there. Watch your hair. All right. Cops come, yeah. <laughs> Holy fuck, dude. Fuck yeah. <laughs> we gotta go. Cops are coming. <laughs> it's a long day, Tyler. Hell of a day in the life. A lot of fucking slams, dude. Skateboarding requires slams. We gotta go. This is the room. These are my boards. <laughs> oh shit, you shot that. You shot that one. Oh, the nose one? And you shot this one. You shot both of these. This is Narlos. That's Narlos. McWethy. McWethy. Oh, fuck. Right under it. Not gonna shoot the train, they get pissed. Don't shoot the train. All right, ready? Bullseye right here, chest. Oh my God, I got it. I got two and one. I got, I got double shot. I got one right under the last one. Stiggles, what's up homeboy? I'm wrapping up at the house right now. I'm on my way to the ocean. Where are you at? Cool, I'll see you in a second. There's no one here. I saw everyone. Jake's here, we're here, we'll be there in a sec. What's up, homeboy? What's up, brother? Dude, two and one. <laughs> Woo! We're about ahead of the ocean, you see that, right? Look at that. Look at that. What? All right, I'll see you in a second. We're there right now, bye. Let's go, gentlemen and lady. Let's go, we all have to cross the street. All of us cross the street. We're here, round two. Ocean. I brought some team riders. The skate juice guys. Get it, Gibbons! Oh! Found St. Gibbons. Hi, hi. How you doing? That's my guy. I'm jumping in the water right fucking now, dude. I had a long ass fucking day. I was supposed to be here like four hours ago.
Thank you everyone for tuning in. I hope you guys had as much fun as I did today. Uh, thank you True Skateboard Mag for this opportunity and I'll catch you guys on the next session. Hell yeah, cheers. Lo puedo hablar en castellano. Gracias a todos que miran mi video de patineta y te veo la próxima vez. Adiós, Cristian.